We're really excited to host this weekend. You know, it's a great opportunity for not only our program, but Xavier Athletics as a whole to host the first ever uh, Big East Championship. And we've got a great venue. It's definitely a true championship location. And we can't wait to have all the teams down for the weekend. Yeah, so you know, part of our role this weekend is, is hosting the meet. Uh, we've had a great partnership with Ben Huffman from um, you know, the Kings Island Golf and Tennis Center. You know, he's done a, a great job out at the course, helping us out with a lot of the setup, a lot of the logistics. Also, Tania Kennedy from the Big East. She's the championship director, and she's worked side by side with our staff throughout the process to make sure we put on a first class event. Yeah, our women's team has looked really strong all, all season. Uh, we've got Maddie Britton, who's healthy again. Uh, we should see her up in the, in the mix, definitely in the top five. We uh, just kind of comparing over the last couple of years, this is definitely our strongest team, uh, especially up front. Caroline Gosser, our freshman, and uh, Sarah Maisie, you know, one of our seniors, along with Katarina Karas. But, um, you know, I, I think it's, it's, you know, in the conference, you've got uh, Providence and Georgetown. I think they're pretty clear uh, front runners on Saturday. Beyond that, you've got Villanova probably in that third spot. But the rest of the conference is really wide open. So we're really excited to see what we can do uh, and really mix it up with Butler, who's been running really well, Creighton, who's been running really well, and Marquette, who's been running really well. Yeah, we had a really young team last year. The bulk of our top seven were freshmen. They've had a year to grow, a year to really learn the system, um, you know, develop quite a bit, and they've come back this year a lot stronger. So we are definitely looking to put five girls in front of where our number one girl finished last year, both at this meet and at the regional meet coming up um, in Madison in two weeks. On the men's side, you know, we've had a strong top two or three uh, throughout the season. We're still trying to bridge some of those gaps between our number four, five runner and our one, two, three. So that's really the focus for this weekend. Uh, Garrett Napick and Aaron Peterson look great. We've got a few other guys. Uh, Ryan Nephew, one of our freshmen, has come on really strong at the end. So definitely be counting on them for some of those top spots. And uh, hopefully some of those guys that have been in our top seven throughout the year are able to bridge the gaps on Saturday.